Hi everybody, welcome back, and for the first time in a while, I have a special guest commentator, the Darren. What's up, man? What's up, man? The Darren here. The Darren, a new, brand new guest commentator who's never been here before, and he's watching me play some Zelda, man. Yep, good old Zelda. <laughs> Probably, this was like the last, well, 2D Zelda game released on a console. It'd be nice to see a new one. On a council, well, yeah, I mean, uh, I guess despite not including like um, four swords, but four swords, or, yeah, the handhelds and all that, right? Well, I'm talking about council. That's yeah. I don't count handhelds, you know. Yeah. Anyway, uh, what I did real quick because NCS mentioned it when I was on a call with them yesterday, I relocked this thing because I actually need to lock it again. It's weird. I don't know how to explain it. I, keep, I forget the name uh, of those things I are. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. I don't remember this dungeon at all. From the looks of it, it's like one of those watery dungeons and just taking a while yeah, this to get is like the, the Yeah, this is like the water dungeon of the Dark World. It's really weird. Every single Zelda game has to have a water temple. Hell yeah. So tell me, man, how do you feel about all these hackers going around? Or whatever you want to call them. Well, I think it's kind of just stupid. <laughs> we can all get our accounts back, you know, but it's like... Why would you waste your time trying to do false claims and stuff like that? Well, if, yeah, it's, I, just I, it's really dumb, you're right, because it's kind of like, I and I uh, mentioned it to uh, Nintendo Capri Sun yesterday when I was talking to them on uh, Skype or whatever. I told him, I was like, you know, if you're gonna, if you're gonna um, waste your time flagging LPRs or whatever, they'll just end up getting their account back anyway. You know what I mean? Yeah, so it's like... Unless it's like legitly the company said no, just epic no. Ooh, we got the big uh, right key. The entire. Ooh, not bad. Sweet. Can they like alternate name between boss key and big key for some strange reason? I think <laughs> the big key. I the, can swear. The, the the big key. That's not. That doesn't sound dirty at all. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you working on, Darren? What are your current projects? What's what's going on with you? Well, I'm currently just on a little break from Let's Playing, right. you know, because my birthday coming up and that. Yes. And then when I come back, I'm hoping to start up a Nintendo 64 game if I am a Ninten new Nintendo 64. Nice. Or do a little simple game while I wait for it. Wait, you're getting yeah. a you're getting an N64 now? Yeah, I don't have a one anymore. But I'm getting a new one because good games on. You can it. emulate it. Game. My, well, I don't know about your computer. My computer is actually strong enough to emulate it, so that's pretty cool. My computer can emulate it, but emulation's very iffy for most games that's past SNES. You know, it's a bit glitchy. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. Uh, anyway, anyways, I just... The worst thing to ever do. Yeah, anyways, uh, you know? while we're talking, I just got the hook shot. Everyone's favorite item in the Zeldas. It looks ghetto in this one, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks awesome in this one. <laughs> And obviously it's going to come in handy for the dungeon boss. And now I have no idea where I'm going, to be honest. And I wish you knew... I wish you you played this one before, because... I get... What the hell? Aww. <laughs> that was just a tease. You get right up to the door and it closes. Yeah, I hate that. I don't know... Like I said, I never really played any of the 3D Zelda, so you'd have to tell me, you know, if you see similarities or not. Ah! Oh, there's definitely... Like, the hook shot is definitely in every Zelda game. Yeah. And so, some items, some similarities, some puzzles, but it's the same. Yeah, let me guess, I went the wrong way. Of course. <laughs> God. Of course. Of course. It just has to happen at some point. Yeah. So, your birthday's coming up. What do you got planned? You going to the nudie bar? On my birthday? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm just going to enjoy it, you know? Just enjoy my birthday. I hear you, It only man. comes once a year, you know? How old are you turning? Fifteen. Oh my god, you're a youngin. I feel old. Thanks a lot, man. Where am I? No problem. <laughs> how, do I, how do I get in there? Uh, see, now... now... Don't worry, most people are surprised when I tell my age. 
15. Well, a lot of LPers are around your age, anyways. You know, I know a lot. Of yeah, but like some people, even if they see a picture of me, they're confused that I'm only 15. Yeah. You know. Well, I've, I've li you know, obviously, I've listened to a lot of your LPs, and you sound a lot more mature for your age, anyway. So. Oh, I'm I'm a pretty mature guy. <laughs> but I'm, not, I'm sure you're not talking about, uh, you know, brain-wise or whatever it's called. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! No, I'm just always been... Sorry, that excited me. <laughs> <laughs> I drained all the water. Which way? Which way should I go, up or down? Uh, well, up it looks like there could be where the boss is, so... Uh, you already have the what you need to fight the boss, so... Yep. Don't you? Yeah, pretty much. So I guess I just came here for some hearts and rupees. Rubies or rupees? Why would they bother putting rubies in a treasure chest still? <laughs> I don't know. What's oh here's here's a bunch of hearts right now, just a bunch of garbage. See I get lost in this dungeon a lot more than any other dun well I can't I shouldn't say that. I do get lost in oh boy. Which way? Which one? Um, I have no idea. I guess this one. I'm hoping. Well, there's stairs leading up, so <laughs> probably. I, I'm just saying that because if it goes up, then it's probably the right way. Or it goes down, so I'm getting it. I don't know, I guess. Uh, uh, I think there's a key here. Oh my god. Yes! Ah! Awesome. The current! I'm just going to ignore that bomb. There's a current. Yeah, I'm just thinking. Oh, we're at the boss. So, oh, you used that key to get in. I couldn't see very well. Yeah, I went real fast, yo. So your your Skype recording glitched. All right, this boss is really easy, man. You just gotta keep grabbing it's eyeball blob. eyeball piece by piece with your hook shot. Take him it's out. Until, yeah, take him out until basically there's no eyeballs left. It's really easy. Easier than the last boss, in my opinion. Besides moving and doing that spread attack, does it do anything else, really? No. Well, after I kill all his little eyeballs, he does. You'll see. But this is the this is literally the easiest boss, I think. Well, I said that about a million bucks, but this is one of the easiest bosses in the game. Seriously. You don't That's like it. you don't like fried squid? No. Why not, man? See, I come from a Portuguese what? culture, so we eat fried squid. It's it's good stuff. Well, to be fair, I've never really given it a fair try, so I will have to give it a fair try before I can say anything. <laughs> Alright, there you go. His eyeballs are all dead. Now watch what happens. Actually, I'm going to try something here. I'm going to get my arrows. I'm going to see if it, my arrows work. Oh, boy. That... Jeez. Why you had to uh, jump up in the air and smash into the ground just to do that? I don't know. Uh -huh. it seems to be unnecessary. Ah, uh, yeah! Gotcha, bitch! Sorry about my language. <laughs> ah! Sorry, I'm having too much fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Get die! Not even a chance to hurt you. Uh. Nah, it's pretty easy. Actually, I'm making it harder than it really is. I don't know why. It's um kind of hard to do, you know. Yeah, I, I'm making it harder than it is with the arrows. I shouldn't be like. There, he's dead. See, I was making it harder than it is. I didn't need to go through all that. Yay! We got a heart! And... The second crystal of the dark world. <laughs> How many are there? Like, seven? Uh, eight. Eight, or something like that? Yes, eight. Yeah, and yeah. now we save the, se the second maiden, and I'm gonna let the Darren do the honors. Except it's not really gonna okay. be the Darren. You'll see what I mean. Speak. Speak, <laughs> my fair maiden. Speak. Link, because of you, I can't escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. The Triforce will grant the wishes of whoever touches it, as long as the person lives. That is why it was hidden in the Golden Land. Only a select few know of its location. But at some point, that knowledge was lost. The person rediscovered. The Golden Land was Gandorf, the evil thief. No, really? Luckily, he couldn't figure out how to return to the light world. Well, remember that you? 
have magical powers, which only the hero can make the most of. There are some other magical warping points like this one you saw in Death Mountain. By using them, you can go between the two worlds and find the evil skin in the dark world. You are the only one who can destroy Ganondorf. Beat no Ganon, but King of Evil. <laughs> <laughs> I butchered that last one. Do you understand, Do you understand everybody? No, really. <laughs> yes. <laughs> May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. We're all out of time for this episode. Thanks for coming, Darren. We'll see no you problem, guys man. next time for more Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. Later, everybody. Bye. See ya. <laughs>